Hello YouTube and Preppers, this is the comms Prepper with a video on my bug out bag radio power system. Over the weekend I was charging up the bug out bag radio battery and the battery failed. You can see the bulge there on the side of the battery. And while disappointing, the timing couldn't have been better. Uh, we had just received two products from Harden Power Systems to demonstrate for you guys here on the channel. Their standard backpack and then their backpack solar system. So with the battery failure, we made a trip to Home Depot, picked up a new battery, made a trip to Ham Radio Outlet to buy some Anderson Power Pole connectors so I can make some custom cables. And I'll put links down below. As I make more videos, I'll be featuring these products in the videos, but I want to do a quick introduction for you. Uh, the solar backpack here actually has connections here to plug in a 12 volt solar power array. These units are made with 3D printers and they actually strap on to the top of these type of batteries. The solar unit has a push button on off switch which turns on an LED voltmeter here. There's two leads to come off for your load, your radio, maybe an external modem that have the Anderson power pole connectors here and spade connectors here that connect to the top of the battery and then these velcro straps wrap around the battery to hold it in place. If solar power is not a requirement of yours you can get their standard backpack unit. In this case there's an on off switch here that powers the LED voltmeter here and then you have two Anderson power pole connections here again. One's fused, one's unfused to power radio and maybe power a peripheral device like in my case I have the SCS modem and there's the actual fuse for that unit there. So what I'll do is I'll strap the basic unit onto the battery so you can see how it looks and then again you'll see these two products more and more in future videos as I get the bug out bag radio into the field. Alright I hope you guys can see that okay. This is the standard unit with the velcro straps wrapped around the battery holding it on there. We've actually pulled out the load connections here where you can make standard Anderson power pole connections. In this case I have a cable for the modem and the radio. You have the voltmeter that's hooked up to the switch here on the side so you can check your batteries. And this is a real solid connection. These units are made with 3D printers. So this is a really nice addition to the bug out bag radio. I'd like to say thanks to Harden Power Systems for providing them so I could do these demonstrations for you guys. And as I put the bug out bag radio back together, you'll be seeing this unit again and this unit as well because we're going to get a 30 watt solar panel and use that for charging the bug out bag radio in the field. So these are two really neat products, well built, and we'll be seeing a lot more of them here on the channel. And as always, thank you for watching my videos and subscribing to the channel. This has been the comms prep with a short introductory video on Harden Power Systems backpack products. And maybe a little safety reminder to keep an eye on batteries when you're charging them because this could have been a disaster for us if I hadn't walked out to the garage and caught it in time. Thanks for watching, guys.